Well, hey everybody. We're just hanging out here at the patio at Peter Peter Brewing, and hanging out with Medry and uh, having a beer. So just talking about Small Business Week and all the exciting things going on in town and celebrating small businesses. Um, yeah, thanks for coming. Um, my husband and I, Tyrell, opened in 2018 with Peace River Brewing. Um, we never really thought it was going to be what it's become. Um, we've now actually expanded into distilling, which we just launched at the beginning of this year. And with that, we've been able to have lots of events, um, kind of become a community hub, I would say. Um, incorporating beer yoga and bingo and live music, comedy, that kind of thing. It's awesome. I think that the community has embraced you guys big time. So word on the street is that you guys are maybe making a move too. Yeah. So with that, we've um, actually decided to relocate. It's kind of bittersweet. Um, we are moving away from some of our neighbors downtown here, but we are staying in the area. We're going to be just across from the movie theater right near the uh, old or inside the old liquidation world building. Um, we're very excited. Um, it's all thanks to the community. The only reason we could actually do this. Um, I think we just really want to thank all of the other businesses that are in town that have us on tap, carry us in the liquor stores, that kind of thing. The only reason we can do what we're doing is because of Peace River. So we're just super happy. Thanks. Yeah, well, we're excited for you. It's awesome that you guys' business has grown to the point where you guys can expand it. And it's always nice to see a local success story, a small operation that is just growing beyond your guys' wildest dreams. So congrats to you guys. Thanks, man. I'll cheers to that. So Medri, being a brewery in the north, are there any advantages or benefits that you guys have realized from that? Um, I think they were really able to support our local farmers, which we appreciate. Um, once we opened the distillery here at the beginning of 2022, we were actually able to use a large portion of unmalted barley within our grain bills. And then I think two is with the spent grain from the brewing process, we actually provide a local farmer here with um, feed for their pigs. And we brought that full circle by having a pop-up shop today. Um, which lots of patrons have enjoyed and we've done it yearly. Interesting, I bet lots of people didn't know that you guys actually utilize grain from local farmers and after you're done with it, you give it back to local farmers. So that's a pretty cool thing. So yeah, awesome.